going to go ahead and log into an account I already have. And I'm just going to walk you quickly through the portal navigation. So now that I'm logged in, you'll notice that I have some additional menus up here in the top menu bar. Um, this home icon is going to take me back to the district court public homepage to the e-filing site. The civil case search is going to take me back to a place where I can search for cases that are in our system. We are converting all of our data from our existing systems into eCourt. So any cases that you have today, you'll be able to see an eCourt going forward. And you can search by case number or party name. Here in the actions menu is probably where you're going to spend most of your time. Case access is where you're going to enter a case number and a token to give yourself access to cases you've not created. This will be how you get access to cases that we're converting over from our existing systems. Civil case initiation is exactly that. That's where we're going to create new filings and send them to the court for review. My cases will show you a history of cases that you filed via the portal, as well as cases where you've turned on your token access. And then finally, my filings is going to show you a history of documents you filed into cases. Um, this is separate from my cases because it is possible for you to file documents into a case that is not yours. And so these are tracked outside of the case tracking.